Well, it's time to have some lunch. Here's some shish kebibble that I made the other day. Uh, the red LED is chooching on it, which makes it look not entirely terribly appetizing. You can see the diffraction over there. But out of that light, it looks a lot more appetizing. And we're going to use the nice uh, GE Spacemaker 2 microwave from 1987. So we'll stick that in. Apparently the sticks are a little long for it, so we'll have to go like that. And we're going to cook stuff. So we'll do time cook. And I'm going to do it for five minutes at power level 50. And there it is without its turntable. It just sits there and it just runs. And you can watch as the magnetron goes on and off. I don't remember how many watts this microwave is. But it's all pulling off of all the lights at the bar circuit here. There, you can see that brighten up. The fluorescent dims and brightens. Magnetron on. And off. Hopefully you saw that. The LEDs don't seem to really get bothered by it. It's on. And off. The 150 watt bulb over the table is at full chooch. The magnetron just turned on. And off. So I don't know if you could see that. I'll go to the table. Maybe you can tell there. It's on. And off and we'll dim this way down it's on and off so I think you definitely saw that let me see if I could dim it all the way yeah actually it dimmed and I think it went out completely Oh, it did come back. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's watch that again. Wow, it's probably just barely keeping current flowing through there. <laughs> that is pretty cool. And let's see if the bar sign... Yeah, I think it did. It's on now. I didn't see much of a difference on that. The mirror ball? Now, the LED right here does not seem to be bothered by that. I don't think the LED exit sign is either. So it's just really the incandescents, of course, that get bothered by it. Let's see the little string lights here. Yeah, I think they did. About neon. Oh yeah, I could definitely see at least the beer sign. Oh yeah, that was directly on camera, I saw that. <laughs> How about this? Well, the camera sort of lost focus for a moment. Yeah, that brightens up also. But for whatever reason, these LEDs are almost impervious to it. So that's just interesting. Um, this is fluorescent. Turn back off, so we'll 
turn back on in a moment. Now it's on. And off. Yeah, it does. Just ever so slightly. I don't remember the wattage of this. I think it was like 700 watts or something. And the light in there also dims and brightens. That's apparent. So we only have a few seconds left. I guess we'll watch this. I had to replace the green bulb because that burned out. Oh yeah, that was a marked difference right there. Well, it's time for lunch, so thanks for watching. Make sure you hit like, make sure you hit subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.